cauliflower. Now I love cauliflowers, but apparently not as many people do as they used to. 35% decline in sales here in Britain. And then I saw Hyla, who does this amazing cooking channel. She did a whole roast cauliflower, which was looked utterly delicious. And I thought, instead of boiling my cauliflower, as I have done, I was going to roast it. And it just transforms the vegetable. It's so tasty and it's so easy. Because they've got lots of nooks and crannies, they can get little insects or bits of dirt in them. So you have to wash them, but you also have to dry it very carefully before you roast it. Because if you try to roast something that's wet, it will take a bit longer and it will be a bit soggier. Can you get the colander out for me? There are two ways you can cut a cauliflower. You can either just take a paring knife and you can just start at the bottom and just take all the little florets off one by one, like that. The other way is you can literally just cut it down the middle, like that, and then you can cut out the stem and then it will just all the florets will fall off. Now I'm just going to turn the oven on, uh, 220 degrees. It goes in quite hot for the first 10 minutes and then we'll turn it down for the next 10 or 15, depending on how they're cooking. Put those in there, get rid of that little bit. Spread them out so they've got lots of nice space to cook. And I'm going to just normal olive oil, a couple of glugs, a bit of salt. This is sea salt, so it might look like I'm using a lot, but sea salt's actually weaker than table salt. So, And then I'm going to grind lots of pepper over. So you could put you know, whole cloves of garlic in, mm. any kind of thing. So how long do they go in the oven for? About 25 together? minutes. Let's get my hands in. Yeah, it's funny the thing is that sometimes you do something on a blog and you don't expect there to be a massive response. Roasted cauliflower, I just didn't expect everyone yeah. to come out and say, gosh, I'm a secret cauliflower roaster too. There was a lot of revelation. Yeah, it felt yeah. like a support group. Yeah, someone <laughs> emailed me, I haven't put it on the blog yet, saying that she, this might be a bit extreme actually, <laughs> she um, puts it in the food processor and sort of crumbs it so it's like rice and then she wow. uses it as, instead of a carb, she uses it as her... Um, as her actually okay. a great thing to do with cauliflower cheese is if you wanted to do a shepherd's pie or a cottage pie or something or even a lentil pie instead of doing a mashed potato top do a cauliflower cheese top because it's so delicious and really mm. different uh, right that's going to go in for 10 minutes and we'll check it see how it goes so I'm going to turn them now and uh put them back in at a slightly lower temperature just for 15 more minutes. No, I'm fine, I've got a is that fish slice. So that you can see that they're already crisping up on one side. I'm going to slightly turn that down just to 200. Um, and then I'm just going to put this on for another 15 minutes, but I'll check. In fact, I'm just going to leave it, put it on for another 10 and check and see how they're doing. Okay, do you want a cup of tea? Yeah, lovely. Yeah. Yum, 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 yum. Yeah, so, it looks like it should be bad for you almost. But there's some great suggestions um, on the blog. People are doing it with lemon juice and paprika. Um, other people are cooking it with chilli. I think that it's lovely just to let the vegetables speak for itself, y'all. Um, they just salt, pepper and olive oil. So that's roasted cauliflower. Very easy, very simple, very tasty. No one here in this room could believe how tasty it was. Because I think we all think of cauliflower as being a little bit waterlogged and yeah, school dinnery. Yeah, soggy. Yeah, it's very, so that's that a lovely, sophisticated really cauliflower, yeah. <laughs> that cauliflower could almost be... sophisticated and cauliflower being put in the same sentence. Yeah, wow. Impressive. What do you do with yours? Comments yeah. below. And... Like us. Like us. <laughs> We're, we're sisters, sisters and, and together, together we're crumbs. We both like cooking and, and we, we love food and chocolate and red wine.